What's up YouTube? Today I'm doing a video on how to put a uh, spoiler on your 2006 to 2010 Dodge Chargers. My neighbor, Mr. Charles, helped me out. Took the, you know, I'm taking the liberty to, to make it easier for everybody. First off, these little things that come in the little pack when you, when you buy these spoilers, throw that shit in the trash. They ain't no good. That's just a waste. What you need to do is get your tape measure from the end of your tail light right here, you need to measure approximately 15 and a quarter inches, as he's doing right now, to the end to get it get it lined up right. And from the back of your trunk lid, from the bottom of your trunk lid, the spoilers OEM location is approximately an inch from the from the, the line right here of your uh, trunk. As you see, you move it up to a line on both sides. Go to an inch. And it's going to read 15 and a quarter from each side on each side of the spoiler and an inch from the, from the back of the trunk. You center line of your trunk. If you carefully and you look down here on your, your little third brake light right here, it's a dot. You can use that as your center guideline for your trunk. You know, if you want to mark it right here. And also, make sure you use painter's tape or masking tape right here, you know, to mark out the area. So, because we took the liberty. He's, he's checking the measurements again. To make sure it's on point. We took the liberty of making a stencil. Uh, you know, using the bottom of the spoiler or whatever. And, and like I said, taping down with three little points to keep everything held down with your holes already, already marked. Right here like this. So therefore, I can just run the drill straight down through on each side. And then we're gonna we're gonna drill through the trunk. From the bottom, we're gonna run the screws up with the washer and use a little lock tight on the threads to keep it from coming loose or whatever. My truck already sound dead due to my audio, so I ain't gotta worry about you know no spoiler rattle worth anything, you know, with my system pumping. And it's it's good to go. I mean it's it's a lot easier, like I said, than using these little shims, whatever you call these little things that come in the pack. Little templates or whatever. Make your own templates, you come out a lot better. So again, 15 quarter from the end to, to the, this point, an inch from the, the, back, of your, the uh, back of your trunk lid to here. And you, like I said, tape the list, make your uh, template right here up on the bottom of your spoiler. Use that as a cutout. Place that on here and then put your the painter's tape in these three points, keeping it, keep it held in place. And it's that simple. It's good to go. Until then, this is Hemi signing out. Peace.